Alright, Northwex. First impressions, look. Northwex is green and, and, and it's got nice rolls to it. Northwex Golf Course. The good and the bad. And the uh, ugly. And the what? Ugly. And the ugly. The good and the bad and the ugly. Yeah. I'm going to say start off with the good. Bunkers, probably the best I've ever seen them here. Would you agree? I agree. You can see in the background, like they're edged beautifully yep. and that's part of what they've done in the renovations. Yep. It's been renovated, nothing's really changed. I know a few years ago they changed the back nine and the front nine, so now the front nine's the back nine and blah blah blah. But I just find now it's kind of... Maybe the houses have all moved in now and it really does feel like a true resort. You know, before it had a bit of bushland around it and... I think th this to me could be two, a two review system. A review on the price we paid and possibly <coughs> a review on what the price is going to be. Yep. Um, look, I think it's going to go back to $90 or 99 something like that. Which is too much. Which, yeah, it's incredibly too much. But I'll be honest, $49 with the cart is probably where it's at. And that's their renovation special and I think I'd be happy with paying that. 65 bucks is where they're going to go to after their renovation special and that's going to be their special. Yeah. Which yep. I think... Look, honestly, if you want to call yourself a resort, you've got to put a few T's and a pencil on the golf cart. You've got to make sure the bucket, uh, um, the buggies have ice. And because uh, to me, a resort, that's kind of comes with the territory. Definitely. Because otherwise, that there was no different than playing in one team or an Ipswich or anything like that. The buggies were a bit dirty. Yeah. Um, you well, know. At that price category, that's what you're comparing it to. You're comparing it to resort courses. Yeah, yeah. So in that category, Norfolk's is falling down. Yeah. So for the price we're paying and what we're comparing it to yep. um i don't and, think it holds up as well and it's a very competitive <laughs> category but um look i think i think of where it's at i think of the area that north lakes is it's kind of out of the way um it's not sort of like this prime location that gets a trillion people going past it no so i can see why they struggle for numbers <laughs> It's because we've been talking, we've been, we've been finding it hard to find the right phrase. And in no way am I trying to be negative or ripping the asshole of North Lakes, but it's kind of sometimes you'd, I'd rather listen to an honest review rather than just yeah. the cookie cutter. Hey, it's fantastic, go and get out there and do it. Yeah. But to be honest, the way I look at North Lakes, and I, if I was going to compare North Lakes and Redcliffe, I'd say this every course in that middle, middle category, like Redcliffe and Oxley, they have three or four holes that just they, they're not they're not not as good as any other hole in the course. Yeah. They're kind of like fillers, you know. Like yeah. and they, and the course knows it too. They're usually holes that are around the back, away from a road where not many people can see them. Hence why they don't get as much time and effort thrown into them. A course like North Lakes, all those holes are relatively good. Yeah. But I just find that there's no oomph. There's no hole. You know, this is. I, I, I like when you were saying that. I, yeah. I completely agree. Yeah. When you were saying that, I figured out what I don't. What just. It doesn't get it over the line for me. What doesn't get it over the line? It's because none of the holes, none of them, to me, have that wow factor. Yeah. That I go, oh my gosh, I can't wait to get to Brookwater and play that par five down the hill and up the hill again. Yeah, that's right, yeah. It doesn't have a hole or yeah. a signature hole where I'm going, wow. Yeah, I like I, I think I think North Lakes is built for penance players yeah. and uh, I like lower handicappers. Mm. I think they love the course and, and I don't see anything wrong with it. For them, it's not about wow factor holes. It's about how the hole is crafted and what they have to do. And, yeah. and we found because of the long tees, it's just driver, wedge, driver, it's, seven iron, driver. It's it's more of the same constantly. It's kind of like Bravi Island in a way mm. where mm. part... 380 meter par four, 375 meter par four, 400 meter par four, and you kind of think it's oh, more of the same. It's, it's more, more of the same. same, and I think with golf, you know, a lot of people are saying, you know, they're, they're time poor. So if that's the case, you really need to make not you, you need some holes to keep you going. And yeah. actually, what is it? The 12th, the one where it was like it's it's kind of drivable. Um, the hole that I, the one, the last hole we played, that oh, yeah, kind of yeah. nice hole. Yeah. To me, that could be a signature hole. If they is. clean up the water and they kind of make it a little bit more open off the tees, you can see it. That's probably the hole that I remember North Lakes for. Yeah. That and the, t and the ninth hole. Yeah. Coming in along the... The ninth hole, hole yeah, which used to be the old 18th, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and it should be the 19th. Because the, hey, the yeah. starting hole, number one, yeah. what a dumb hole to start on. Yeah. A blocked out that, that, dog leg to the right. To me... you could have used nine off the tee. And it's that just number like, one hole is usually like a par four you throw in the middle of the course somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, today's, yeah... I'm going to say seven and a half out of ten. I'm going to say seven out of ten. Yeah. So you got a solid, solid, a solid seven. Seven point two five. Yeah. yeah. So that's. Um, right. 
So thanks for watching guys, thanks that was watching. our review of North Lakes Golf Course. Still get out and try it out. Yep. Uh, it's maybe not worth the full amount of money, that's all we're saying. Mm. And it's still a tough course, but we really liked it. Yeah. Um, yeah, and I mean, mm. that's the thing we've got to remember, is that our review is based on a personal experience, and I hope you can respect the fact that yeah. we're giving you our honest opinion. Otherwise, we may as well be working for some TV network. <laughs> hey, North Lakes was fantastic. Get out there and try it. Yeah. And we'll just put the lava tile going across the screen. Thanks for the free rounds and balls and, and sponsorship. Thank That's you. That's right. <laughs>